Hello everyone. I would like to start by saying thank you to Ardar and everybody joining us from industry and the research community. Together you folks are helping farmers and ranchers boost their productivity, competitiveness, and sustainability. And most importantly, putting more money in their pockets. As a farmer myself, that's really the bottom line. In my first couple of weeks back in the saddle as Minister of Agriculture, I had the pleasure of meeting with you folks and learning more about the work you do. During that trip, I visited a ranch where I got to see the benefit of rotational grazing and cover cropping, supported by our federal on-farm climate action fund. Ardar is doing such a great job of delivering the programs to producers in Alberta. And I'm pleased to see that so many folks adopt practices that are good for their businesses and the environment. There's no doubt farmers are on the front line of climate change. Drought can destroy what generations have worked so hard to build. So with another possibly difficult season ahead, your discussions today about water are so timely. We're working to help farmers make their operations more resilient to these challenges. That's why we're investing over $470 million to extend AFCAB until 2028. We're also partnering with provinces to deliver some vital programming under the Sustainable Canadian Agricultural Partnership, including drought relief, mental health support, and crop research. So once again, thank you for your passion and commitment to agriculture in Alberta. As I meet with our customers around the world, I can tell you that they want more of our top quality, sustainable food. And thanks to your great work, I have no doubt that Alberta farmers will be able to deliver now and in the future. I wish you all a good meeting and a bountiful harvest this fall and continued success in the years to come. Thank you very much.